everybody, welcome back. It's your boy Worst Seven Gamer, and today I never stop to bring you guys some of the coolest mobile games out there. So we are about to embark on a brand new adventure, guys. This game is called Nexomon. If you're a huge Pokemon fan, if you like all that that genre, this is the same concept as Pokemon, except it's completely different. Over 500 Nexomon to collect from. You capture them, you battle them. It's awesome. So you guys might enjoy this series. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start this new series. If you're excited for something new, drop a like, guys. Let me know that you want to see this content more. Uh, without any further ado, let's just get right into it, guys. Because that Nexomon right there looks awesome. And I can't wait to try him out. So I want to see what this game entails. So without waiting any further, let's just go ahead. Let's begin a new game, guys. And I see already up there it says share to claim a prize on Facebook. So whoa, we might have to do that already. So we are a male. We got to enter our name. As always, we are worst uh, F. Wait a minute. Let's put small letter F. Worst F. Because sometimes when I put my name in, it doesn't let me put too many, um, let's just see if this is going to work. And it worked! We're stepping in work. There we go, guys. We are officially embarking on this adventure now. I'm crazy excited because I want to see what this is about. Like I said before, guys, you can download this on iOS or Android, I'm pretty sure. But let's see what's going to happen. Long time ago, this world wouldn't belong to us, the humans! We were the rulers and masters of this land in this era of prosperity. But then, on one fateful day, everything changed. From the high heavens descended an unspeakable evil, a creature a monster. He proclaimed himself as Omnicron, the king of the Nexamon. This wicked behemoth threatened to engulf our humanity into darkness. With one shattering roar, an eternal war between humans and Nexamon began. Over centuries of violence, humans learned how to tame and befriend the Nexamon, and use them to fight against Omnicron himself. Then, in the midst of a dark age, one brave human warrior rose against all odds. And with the help of his Nexamon companions, he defeated Omnicron. The war ended, and centuries later, we live in a peaceful world along with our Nexamon friends. for Omnicron's darkness was forever destroyed. Or so. Or so we thought. Woo! All right, look at that, the twist. Now we are in present day. So out of nowhere, out of the heavens, this Omnicron sh guy shows up and just starts attacking humans and then humans fight back. They become friends with these. Next of mine, what is this? Oh, wow, look at that, guys. That looks crazy. What is happening to this dude? That's us right there. This is the end of your journey, champion of mankind. My session has been set in motion. Millennia before you uh, were even born into this pretty petty world. None many overcome Omnicron, the almighty king of Nexomon. So that's Omnicorn. He looks pretty sick. Does it look like a mixture of like Suicune and um, Salamence, right? It looks like a mixture of Suicune and Salamence if you watch Pokemon. Pretty sick. On this fateful day, uh, my kind of error. Oh, oh man, I'm not even reading too fast. Now, be gone! Alright. So we start off at a weird part of the game where the, I guess that's us. Or 
the hero of the story fighting against Omnicron. That is us. Our story, Our story begins with a, young with a young and normal human child. child. Little does he know, his life is about to change very, very soon. Woohoo! All right. So pretty dope, guys. Yeah, I guess he's having a dream, maybe, about fighting Omicron. And uh, now he wakes up in the morning. And he has no idea what's coming for him. Or what to do. So we are in our bedroom, as always. Now we're about to embark on this great journey. Investigate the mysterious sound downstairs. Okay. Now, in the typical games, there's all, there's sometimes there's stuff around. These, you never know where you can find some stuff, guys. Always check your... Eh, nothing here. So let's head downstairs and let's see what's... What's all this noise? What's all the hubba hubba? Hubby hubby! Hmm, hubba hubba. Anything here? There's something shiny at the table, I see that. Boom, we got a potion! Alright guys, that could be useful to us. But, it looks like there's some mysterious creatures down here, so let's see what they want. The device is performing marvelously, sir! It is more certainly ready for distribution, shall we? Alright, so this guy looks like a scientist, I guess he's our father and this mysterious guy. I will be the judge of that. Show it to me now. Absolutely! Please, follow me! Okay, so I guess he's testing out this vice for a really strange looking creature guy there. And we don't know what it is yet, so we'll find out. Did the noise wake you up, er, dear? Yes, I was sound asleep. It is nothing to be concerned about, for it is merely another test of our latest invention, so our parents are inventors. Oh, I've always wanted to invent a parent. Too bad my parents suck. They haven't invented jack shit, but it's okay. That reminds me, I believe Eli, Eli has been looking for you, dear. Why don't you go out and find her? She probably wants to show you her new toy. How very exciting. Okay, so... Ali, I guess, wants to... F should we go outside or should we go downstairs and check up on our dad? Nah, let's go outside. Ali's got something to show us. What is it, Ali? Hopefully, it's not a big time waster. Alright, so what's this? Ali! Stay away from us! You can't take Atlas. He's not yours. Alright, so what is this thing? Whoa. Is this some kind of a robot human? Huh? I'm not going anywhere without that robot. So, all our, all, I mean, already, guys, we can tell that this game has a lot to do with robots, I guess. Go away! Come back! Alright, so he's taking the robot from him. I said no! Alright, would somebody just freaking take the damn robot? I'll do it! This is a job for this guy. Alright, so I charged head on first, guys. I guess I attacked the robot, but robots are metal. What is your problem, kid? Look over there! He dropped a Nexomon container! Whoa. I bet he stole it too. We have to take it back. Hey! That's not yours! Now you know how it feels. Alright, so they're fighting for that Nexomon container, guys. How are you so strong? I work out. <laughs> At last, now's your chance. Yes, Master Eli. On my way. What is that dumb robot of yours gonna do? Oh, ho headbutt. That was great. <laughs> he said the flying. Beautiful. Quick! We must take that back. That Exomon. Alright, guys. So, I guess this is our chance where we pick our Nexomon. Our first Nexomon of the adventure here. Whoa, look at all these cool looking options, guys. <laughs> wow. So, uh, it looks like there's seven. You can already tell, guys, there's seven natures in here. You have, uh, probably that's normal at the top over there. Rock, uh, wind, water, fire, electric, and grass or leaf. Wow, look at that. So you get a chance of, so you get one of each type, whichever one you want, guys. I'm not even sure who to get here. Uh, 
Valazy? Is that Valazy? No, I definitely don't want that. That's a lazy little cat there. Blizio. Ooh, that looks sick. Blizio. Fethra. That looks like it's going to evolve into some giant dragon, guys. Wind. Bevy is water. Uh, Sprunk. It's a fire skunk. Uh, Velo Kitty. Oh, it's an electric cat. Ooh, that tempting right there. Electric cat, huh? Let's see. Can I see some stats? Oh, you could. Oh. All right, guys. So normally what I like to do is go with speedsters. I love speedsters speed i never want to go second i always gotta go first high attack and high speed so it looks like attack 127 speed 67 how about this cat attack 133 speed 68 Ooh, that's fast and uh, let's see this spunk right here 59 speed 132 so you know what guys i'm gonna go with this electric yep electric cat here this is velo kitty welcome on the squad yay we got our first next one guys Awesome, that's exciting right there. You received your first next one. Beautiful. Excellent. Now what is back? Hey, what did you do that to my partner? Oh, so this is his partner. It looks exactly like him. Uh forget it. I can deal with you on my own, anyways. Alright, so I guess they come in too, but this dude was somewhere in the back. Hey, use the next one. You just gotta fight him. Okay, perfect. So let's go ahead. Our first battle, guys, of this um What the hell was I gonna say? Anyways, let's just go. I'm all lost here. So, look at this, guys. Velo Kitty versus Ratapon. Ratapon. That's a normal type right there. And uh, the cra the cool thing is, guys, is that when you move your phone around, <laughs> the kind of the screen moves a little bit here. But either way, how do the battling works here? So let's see. He's got three abilities right now, and they all have numbers underneath them. St. Is that stamina? Hundred. Okay, so I think the way that this works is you got your stamina, 100, and then I'm guessing these attacks cost stamina. So each one will cost you whatever this is. So this one is worth 8. Let's see what that is. Ooh, it's like Thunderbolt. Pulse Shot. Oh, it's called Pulse Shot. So you got all different abilities and moves here, guys, that you've never seen before. So that one worked out pretty good. And yep, I was right. It wasted 8 stamina there. Where is this right here? Tackle. Oh, that's Tackle. That one wasted 7, so... I pretty good and then the first one i'm guessing is scratch yep and we defeated him guys ratapon is dead we get our what is that coins oh but our we got some experience as well so nice that's pretty cool guys battle style is very similar to pokemon except it's a little different so you stamina instead of it are you kidding me yes i'm not kidding you dude i just destroyed you get up out of here uh, okay he just got dizzy and dropped down hmm Alright, that was amazing! No way! That was your first next of my battle. Oh, uh, yes, that was my first time, but I've been playing Pokemon for years! Oh, that's right, I should introduce you to my latest invention. This guy's an inventor too. This is Atlas! That's a pretty cool looking robot. Hello there! You're gonna love him. Let me show you what he can do. Okay. What can he do? Oh, rudely interrupted. Hmm, what do we have here? He's the Nexo Lord. What? The Nexo Lord? What does that mean? Who is he and what does he do? The Nexo Lord. The greatest Nexomon tamer in the world, indeed. So he's the best Nexomon tamer in the whole world. And you must be. Well, I don't think that matters, does it now? Uh, how rude. Yeah, it matters. You're gonna know me, boy. Even I cannot keep track of all the weaklings around this petty place. <laughs> what? How messed up is that? Is that your Mex Nexomon kid? Yes, that's mine. So I guess these guys are sweating bullets right here. It does not belong to you, does it? Uh... I guess so. Perhaps you believe you are worthy of using a Nexomon. Do you have what it takes to be a true tamer? Come on, kid! Show me what you can do! What? What was that? Wow! So he just literally... Uh, you have the guts to steal from me? What? That's his? 
Why are you so frightened now? Also, I'm guessing those robots, they stole that from this guy. And then now he thinks that we're the ones that stole it from him. Oh, I see. Keep that next one, brat. Let it forever serve as your shameful reminder of how weak you are. Now, out of my way, if you will. Wow, so he's very rude. Get up, scrub. Oh, what the hell? Oh, so, never mind. They work for him. Yes, my lord. All right, so yeah, they worked for him, so they had that box with him. I don't know if he had it, if it was his, or what What, what the case was. But I guess it was his, and we took one of his next Nexomon. Haha, <laughs> farewell, kids. Pray that we don't cross paths ever again. Whoa, so this... What the... This dude's got some crazy powers. Is he human or what? He just literally transported right out of the screen. How is that normal? Huh. What a nice gentleman. <laughs> All right, so I guess robots like him. I just noticed this guy's in a freaking wheelchair. What? I just saw... Uh, Jeez. Oh, I don't know if you guys saw that before, but he's in a wheelchair. Uh, what is wrong with him? He's obviously planning something evil. Have you noticed anything weird about him? Uh, no, I have not. Like making the ground explode? <laughs> he comes here all the time and must be related to the secret machine your parents are building. Whoa, I knew my parents were up to no good. Maybe, maybe we can follow him. Are you crazy? Follow that guy? Come on now, this isn't a video game. I know, this is real life. Are you freaking crazy, bro? Hey, this could be important. We shall go. I think you're supposed to be smart character in this story. <laughs> I love that robot. Well, here's a smart idea then. We should get another Nexomon. What? This way, we won't have anything to fear while following the Nexolord. Oh, uh, I'm sure Alice can teach you how to capture a Nexomon. Alright, I guess I owe you one for saving me. Alright guys, so I guess Alice is going to take us on an adventure to show us how we're going to capture more Nexomon and become the greatest Nexomon player ever and uh, hopefully defeat the Nexo Lord. Go ahead, you always wanted to learn about Nexomon anyways. I will catch up with you later, okay. Alright, so let's go ahead and let's set off on our adventure here guys. We got our first Nexomon. The Velo Kitty, and actually, let's take a look at some of the features in this game, guys. I'm kind of, uh, what's this? Oh, I guess he's gonna show us how to capture them. All right, let's go ahead. There's the shaking bush. You know what the shaking bush means, guys. Shake it like a shark. Shake it like a shark shaker. How are you? Ready to get a new friend? Yes, I am. I actually need a bunch of new friends. Excellent. Come on with me. All right, let's go. I guess we're going to the bush. Before you start, you will need a Nexo trap. Here, take this. Alright, so we're not using Pokeballs, guys. We're definitely using the Nexo Traps. I thought they were going to be Nexo Balls, but they're not. They're Nexo Traps. So I guess we got to trap Nexomon in these traps. Nexomon live virtually anywhere, but when they see tamers like yourselves, they will try to hide. See the grass over there? Uh, yeah, they're hiding really well. Do you notice something strange about it? Yeah, it's staying very, very still. <laughs> uh, that's right, it is shaking. A next one must be hiding there. Okay. If you approach it, the next one will probably try to defend itself. That's when we will capture it. Go ahead, approach the shaking bush. Let's go. First, next one, guys. Look at this. B Ron. Woo! B Ron. Do I have to attack him or do I just use it? Alright, I guess we just used it. What is this? Golden. Golden Nexo traps have 100% success rates. Oh my god, alright, so if you use this, guys, it is 100% chance that you're going to capture that Nexomon, so that's pretty dope. What is that, like a Master Ball? Some kind of a Master Nexo Trap? But it's golden, so I'm guessing it's good. Alright, success! You, you captured Biron. Biron. We got our first Tekken Nexomon, guys. Look at this guy, he looks pretty cool. Would you like to do with Biron? Add to the party? Add to the party. So that's pretty cool, they give you a choice to add to the party or bring him to your uh, box, the storage. So that's pretty good, capture the first next one. Excellent, nice. B, well done. Okay, so what do we do now? So uh, it looks like there's a medic over there. And what does he want? Hey, I see you finally uh, got two next one. Things should be easier now. Yes, yes, much easier. Hmm. The next one you captured is a little exhausted from 
that last battle, don't you think? Yes, I do. Here, I got some items that you can heal your next one. Okay, good. So we see high, uh, five healing potions to heal our Pokemon. That's pretty good. Healing uh, is a next one is really simple. Just open your menu and add apply on the potions already. Okay, cool, cool. No problem. Always keep your next man healthy. Remember that most cities have a healing center. You can use free healing center. Okay. So these are just the basics, guys. Uh, this is kind of like the tutorial of the game. Are you ready now? Because I got a plan. I've lost track of the next lore, but there is another way to learn about him. Okay, what is it? There is a powerful tamer called Ivan who lives in Perum Town. He is an overseer. What is an overseer? Overseers are great tamers who are chosen by the Nexo Lord himself. He must know something. All right. Perum Town is really close. How about we pay Ivan a visit and ask him about Nexo Lord? So I'm guessing overseer guys are probably gym leaders. They're chosen by the Nexo Lord to rule, and you gotta battle them. That's one. I'm guessing that's what it is. All right, let's go. Let's go. It will be fun to meet powerful tamer. Okay, nice. Be careful. Out there already, I might, uh, I will contact you as soon as I learn about the next oh lord, okay? Alright, so I guess we're taking off from Ali, Eli here, and, uh, that is the end of that chapter. And so, our young heroes embark on a journey to the small town of Peru. They hope to meet Ivan, the overseer of the town, who might know something about the mysterious next oh lord. Wow. Alright guys, so that's pretty much going to do it for episode 1 of Nexoman. I will end it off here, and I will catch you guys on the next part of Nexoman. Hope you enjoy it. Like I said before, drop a like, leave me a comment guys. Do you play this game? Have you played it? Are you going to play it? Try it out. It's not a free game guys, it costs like 3 bucks to play, but it seems like it's worth it in my opinion right now because um, so far so good. I'm liking it. And if you want to watch me just play it, and then uh, later on decide it's worth it, you can try it out then. Or if you want to play along, you go, you, you know, you can go ahead and do that. All right. So for now, I'm gonna end it off here, guys. I will catch you next time on another episode of Nextoman.